Hey guys, it's Patrick. It is uh, Monday afternoon. Uh, just finished with work. I am on the couch, so the cat is very interested in what I'm doing. You might see her tail, you might see her in just a second. Um, she's looking at me as I'm looking at you, so I'll try to get through this without the cat actually knocking things over. Um, <clears throat> anyway, uh, this weekend I had uh, lunch with a couple that I know. A uh, nice man, nice woman who uh, uh, we, I did a lot of theater with. And they, uh, the guy in the couple said that he had been inspired by me, by the pictures that I had posted on Facebook and the video of me, um, of all the pictures uh, of me growing my hair out for a year. Oh, can you see that? Let's see if we can get the cat. There's a claw. <laughs> I have a prop. Um, so uh, he said... Uh, he was inspired by me. His hair had grown for a couple months, and he said, uh, so what's your advice for how do I grow my hair out? What? Can you see the tail? <laughs> Kitty, get down. Get down for just a second. Um, uh, what advice do you have for me for growing out my hair? How, how do you do it? And I said, don't cut it. That's all the advice I have. Don't cut your hair. That's basically the only advice I can give you is if you want it to grow, um, don't cut it. That's basically the only thing you can do. Um, another friend of mine who uh, I know online had posted a picture of himself with longer hair than he's had for a while and he said, oh, I just went in and got a trim. It's been a couple of months and I figured I should get a trim, which is perfectly fine. Um, you can get a trim if you want to keep your ends healthy or whatever. But I, th I then have uh, seen a number of videos from guys who are just starting out. They're in like month three, month four. They're getting a little bit... Um, they're getting a little bit discouraged because they're saying, oh, my hair isn't really growing as fast as I expected. And I just wanted to put a real, um, a real visual to how much hair growth you can expect. Um, we all see our monthly updates by people, but I think that we kind of, um, uh, find the, the guys like myself. I didn't post any updates at all until I had grown my hair out for at least a year, probably about 13, 14 months, um, which is kind of cheating a little bit, but I wasn't sure that I was going to get through it because I kept thinking, oh, it's not growing fast enough. Anyway, what I have, I've looked up, you know, how quickly does your hair grow? And I think a lot of guys already know this. Your hair grows at about a half an inch a month. If your hair grows really, really fast, it might grow as much as an inch a month. But pretty much you can expect six inches of growth in a year. Uh, if your hair is healthy, if you don't have any problems growing it, that's going to be six inches of growth. Um, and I know guys sometimes have trouble with measurements, especially in inches, for various reasons. So I'm going to show you this little red ribbon is six inches. I've measured it. Um, this is uh, six inches of growth um, is what you would expect. Now, when you think about that, if you are starting out from a very short haircut, it has to grow from the top of your head and make its way down. Now, six inches of growth from the side from my ears this is make a very nice mullet go all the way down to my shoulder blades but if we're talking from the top of your head that's gonna get down to maybe your lips maybe your upper lip and from the very from the center of your crown that's not even really enough to get down to your ears really you know see that's about six inches of growth so when I say don't cut your hair I mean, just don't cut it. Um, if you're finding that it's becoming really damaged, uh, of course you may want to go in for a trim. But when you talk about trims, a half an inch a month is not very much. And what I've done right here, see this white bit? That's why it's two-sided. See this little white bit right here? That is a half an inch. That much. That little tiny, tiny, tiny amount. That's a half an inch. That's how much you can expect to grow in a month. And if you've ever grown a beard, you can tell that's, you know, if you grew that off your face, that's about what you would get in a month. It would be a bit shaggy. In relation to the rest of the six inches, that is a very small amount. From your six inches, that's a tiny bit. If you go in for a trim, um, that bit, I would, I would be willing to bet that most barbers or hairdressers are not going to cut off less than that. They're probably going to cut off about that. Um, you know, if you've got a split end, it's not going to be a quarter inch. Um, it's not going to be a centimeter. It's going to be at least, you know, about that much. So um, you want to give yourself enough of a chance. You want to give yourself enough uh, time for it to grow as far as it can. And remember, your head is 
round-ish, <laughs> not perfectly round, you're not Charlie Brown, but um, your head is has a long way to travel, you know? Again, this is, if you're thinking two years, that would be a foot, you know, 12 inches. And if you're going from the top, two years might get you down to your shoulder blade from there. Depends where you start. If you start from, I started from what I called uh, finger length on top, which was, it's about, it's about that much. So my hair was, you know, it, it got down to about here. So when I had about six inches from, from my bangs where it grows, that would be about where it is right now, which is right down about below chin level. And from the back, this is why I've, I've got the sort of mullet going on. I didn't even it out, um, and I probably won't for a while. But anyway, so um, if you're looking for advice on how quickly your hair is going to grow, um, if you're average, which most of us are, it's going to be that little tiny bit every month, um, about an inch a month. Um, if you're looking for what's going to happen in about a year, that's about as much as it's going to be. That's your year. Um, and if you want advice on whether or not to cut it during the first, uh, the first several months, I would say no. Um, you probably are not going to find a stylist who isn't going to be uh, able to cut less than what you've grown in a month. So give it a few months at least. Um, give it some chance to actually show the length of it before you start. And now that uh, she's been very, very patient, um, see if I can get her. Let's see. She's been very patient. So there we go. She's going to now have fun. 